I don't normally video review books. Usually I just write something down. But in this case, I think this book is a little bit more on the visual side. So I think the video is going to be more important here. One thing I would compare this to is this is a children's writer's guide in the way that this one is for adults. And I love this book so much. It's just great inspirational starts. It gives you great ideas. You know, you're supposed to write out a piece of clothing you keep just for the memory or, um, let me see. Find a short story you haven't yet read, read the first two thirds, then pick up the story where it leaves off and writes its ending, write its ending. You know, little, little prompts that give you inspiration. Some of them are actually really, really creative prompts and I love it. I didn't pick the best one, sorry. This one also has prompts, but they first start by introducing the eye guy and he talks to the children a little bit. Um, I'm probably a little bit too old for the audience because I didn't really relate to him, but again, I'm an adult, it's written for children. So the eye guy, he talks about himself a little bit, makes jokes about his eyeball falling off, um, has them fill in the books, the titles, and then has them do a little bit of writing and venting. So it's, it's the same idea. You've got your little prompts here and you fill it in. Here you've got some weird words, so it's also giving them um, a better feel for words that they could be using, ones that they might not know, like cantankerous, that's a good one. Um, what is that one? Canoodle? <laughs> so that's cool. I like that page. Um, really weird story. The weirder the better. Good. Kids will like that. Gives them room to write. Uh, it also at some point was talking about first person and third person. Here's one. So they are talking about moving from writing a story in first person and then changing it so it is now in third person. Get a little bit of drawling in there. So you can see how this is going to be helpful if you're hitting the right age group. Well, I hope that helps you get a good idea if this is what's going to work for you or if you're a hesitant writer. I know I have a hesitant writer, but he's not quite the right age group as I had hoped. He is more in the stuck up age group is what he is. But again, I would compare it very much to the adult writing prompts where it just gives you inspirational ideas. You know, it, it gives you uh, a kick in the butt to write something that normally you would not be writing. Something completely off the wall and out there to make writing fun. All right, I hope that helps you decide if this is what you're looking for.